Seaweed soup is a simple dish that our family enjoys. It's not greasy nor strongly flavored, but it's definitely healthy and nutritious. Here's what we'll need: 10 grams of dried seaweed, a box of tofu, bok choy, and meatballs. If you don't have bok choy at your house, you can also substitute it with cabbage. For the meatballs, we're using mixed milk fish, or also called shi mu yu gen in Chinese. If you don't have this ingredient, don't worry, any kind of meatballs will do. The dried seaweed we're using today is from Korea. Take out 10 grams of dried seaweed and then add cold water into the bowl. It only takes about 2 minutes to let the dried seaweed absorb the water. In the meantime, you can wash the bok choy and also chop the tofu. Heat up the oil in the pot and pour in the seaweed. Frying the seaweed will enhance the flavor. So after we add water in the pot, the flavor of seaweed will still be kept in the soup. Next, add water into the pot. Cover the pot and wait until it's boiled. Then add the rest of the ingredients. We're putting in the meatballs first. We're using meatballs instead of raw meat because these kinds of meatballs are already cooked when we buy them. So it's going to be faster for us to cook. Afterwards, we can add tofu and bok choy. I like vegetables to be crunchy, so I'm cooking the stem first and then the leaves. Last, add salt and white pepper. Turn off the heat and softly stir it. I absolutely love the color of the soup. It's so easy to make. Only 5 minutes and you have the seaweed soup.